What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I'm going to tell you guys, show you guys about probably the one weapon in the game for PvP which is better than the Suros Regime. But before we get into the video, can I just state if you guys are new to my channel and do enjoy daily Destiny content, be sure to subscribe and if you could help this video reach 3000 likes that would be flipping insane if we could. Now the Galahad E is a rare auto rifle. Uh, you can get various different versions of it. I've got one which is a like level 12. I actually acquired this on my third Hunter character when I was leveling them up. I think I got it at about level 14 and I almost dismantled it. But before I did, I checked out its mods and I saw this one right here, Focused Fire. When zoomed, this weapon fires slower but causes additional damage. And it clicked in my head that this is the exact same mod that the Suus Regime has and which makes the Suus Regime an absolute flipping tank to use in PvP. Now, PvE, this weapon, the one I've got isn't that great. I mean, it's only a level 12. Once you go up against enemies which are like level 20, level 30, you just can't do nothing. These bullets just bounce off them. But you can get, like I said, a level 20 version of this weapon and it may be better for PvE. But this is a PvP review. Um, there's so many better weapons for PvE. You wouldn't even bother with a Galatadi. But PvP and a PvP review, this weapon is an absolute tank. And I would say... It's better than the Suicide Regime for the simple fact is that it's a rare weapon, meaning I can equip an exotic weapon while using this Galahad E. So I can use an Icebreaker at the same time, I can use a Patience and Time, I can use the Infective, I can use a Thunderlord, I can use the Dragon's Breath, the, Gal uh, the Galahorn. That's what I'm saying. This is an absolute flipping animal. Now, I'll run you through its stats and I'll talk about the damage, it, well, the damage output it does. Red Dot OAS, Snapshot Sight, Enhanced Target Acquisition. We have Red Dot OREs, Flexible Sight, enhances, ra uh, enhances Handling Range and Recoil Control. Then we have uh, Focus Lens, FLS2, Agile Scope, Modest Zoom, Light and Snappy. Then we have the Legendary Focus Fire. When zoomed, this weapon fires slower but causes additional damage. We have one of two damage upgrades. Then we have Skip Rounds, Ceramic Jacketed Rounds, Ricochet on Hard Surfaces. There, Extreme Density lets you carry more rounds in reserve. Then we have a way added mass slows down weapon handling. And then we have Hand Loaded. This weapon is effective at extended range. Now, I did try it out in PvP on my level 12 or 13 Hunter and I was absolutely owning everybody and I just couldn't understand it. I thought it must have been something to do with lag. I mean, people were using Vexes against me, Suyossi, Shadow Prices, Vanquishers, Grim Citizens, whatever. And I still, 90% of the time, were dropping them in a heartbeat and I just couldn't understand why. I put it onto my main character, I leveled it up further, leveled up to the max actually. Took it back into PvP to do some bounties and it was the same story again and again. I was just owning people and I just... I just I just, I just couldn't believe it. This weapon, this Galahad E is an absolute tank. And yes, there is different versions of it. Different ones with different mods. But if you do happen to come across this one with a Focus Fire mod, definitely keep it, keep it for PvP. Level it up and just keep it for PvP. Store it in your vault, whatever. Now, the damage output on this is an average of 29 to the body and 36 to the head. That is a, basically the exact same as the Suicide Regime. The Suicide Regime is an average of 30 to the body and 36 to the head. It's basically the exact same weapon, probably got three bullets uh, less in its magazine. But other than that, the weapon is basically identical to the Suicide Regime. Now, I'll compare its mods to it, and you'll see that the Suicide Regime has slightly better impact, but damage is capped in PvP anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Yes, the range and stability on the Suicide Regime is better, but let me tell you guys, when you use that Focus Fire mod on any weapon, the stability is so easily controllable, it's ridiculous. And you guys will see, in the PvP footage at the end of the video, me using it and terrorizing people online, and I actually wasn't um, even trying to control the recoil. It's just the back, there's hardly any bounce there whatsoever. This Galahad E is an absolute animal, especially for that PvP. And like I said, I would pull it up there above the Suicide Regime just for the simple fact for PvP anyway, and don't get it twisted, guys. PvP only, I'm talking about, not PvE. Just for the simple fact is I can equip an icebreaker with this, I can equip. Uh, the super good advice with this that's what i'm saying you can equip an exotic weapon with this galahad e for pvp so if you like to use your galahorn your rocket launcher which tracks onto people you like to sit back and snipe people with your icebreaker but you want a decent auto rifle to drop people up close this galahad e is an absolute flipping animal and like i said there are different versions of it you can get level 16 level 20 versions of it which will differ in mods i believe but if you do happen to come across this one 
If you come across a Galahad E, make sure you check its mods before you dismantle it. A lot of people like me wasn't even checking these rare weapons mods. I was just dismantling them straight away. But because I was on my third level 14 Hunter, I was checking mods or level 13 Hunter. I was checking mods just to see if they were better than the current weapon I had. This weapon is an absolute flipping tank. Trust me, guys. Now, uh, guys, enjoyed a little bit of PvP footage. If you do come across this, like I said, level it up and try it out and let me know your opinion on it. If you've got this weapon, let me know your opinion on it. If you've got different mods, let me know down below. But guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Do drop a like. I do appreciate the support. And peace out until next time. Peace. Go, go, go.